guys. So jadi kali ini gue Tere di sini lagi mau ngadain Half Ice Challenge di mana kita bakal cobain makanan khas Indonesia bareng tiga pemain asing dari Tangerang Hawks Basketball. So guys, maybe you can introduce yourself first to the camera. I'm Nick Stover. I'm Kenya Williams. Stephen Green. Ya, jadi mereka ini adalah pemain asing dari Tangerang Hawks Basketball. So guys, today we're going to try some Indonesian food and drink, of course, and you can rate and guess what the ingredient is. Nice. Are you Sounds good. Excited? Please? Yes. Yeah. Okay. But before that, maybe we can chit chat first, guys. I have uh, some question for you. So I already have my favorites. My favorite is probably good prep or like chicken smackdown. So chicken I, smackdown. I get this often, yeah, with like, but I only get like level three spicy because already the sambal is crazy. And uh, then I also like iron bakar. Uh, iron bakar I get once in a while too. Those are probably the two I order the most. I'm trying to think what I, of course I like nazi goreng, like meat goreng. Yeah. Nazi goreng is the best one. Extra spicy. Um, yeah, Nick likes spicy food I too. Yeah, I love spicy food too. We went to a ramen place that was really good that I enjoyed as well. Got extra spicy. Love. I haven't had any, so I'm gonna try for the first time. <laughs> we'll try it for the first time. Mm -hmm. Really? So, what do you get in Indonesia? Pasta. You still, you still get pasta in Indonesia? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's okay. But today we will try most of Indonesian food that. Okay. Famous in Indonesia. Okay. Um, I enjoy Indonesia. It's very nice, huge place. I love that we got to travel and see different places, different cities. Um, I enjoy Jakarta. I haven't been that much, that often, but the times that we have been together, that we went, um, I enjoyed my time there as well. It's very warm here. I thought I was used to the heat, but this is a lot hotter than I'm used to. Yeah, a lot of same things like Nick said, but also, you know, BSD is very quiet and Jakarta is just a party city for me. So, um, yeah, those are the two separate things about them. Yeah. Okay, so how about the fans in Indonesia? The fans? Oh, I love the fans. I yeah, the fans the are great. The following great. and social media and everything here is amazing. And I love how into basketball they are as well. So it's very, very good to get a lot of support from everybody. You got more? Here? Yeah, for sure, for sure. Uh, a lot of fans, a lot of people that came out. A little bit, yeah. I yeah, met a lot of different people. A little bit. I like how. How about yeah. home? Uh, just, I mean, for me, playing in like different countries in Asia throughout, like Indonesia is just like, the league is really up and coming. And you see like it's growing every year and there's more and more fans and like the social media has done so well. I think it's really impressive, you know, like the product of like the IBL is becoming really, really good, you know. Um, but generally in Indonesia, like, I love it. I love being here. I think people are just very polite, very nice. I eat well, and just uh, overall, like, every day is good vibes. So I can't complain. I really, so I enjoy my time. Really good, right? Yeah. I think the, ma the, the main difference, if you say, like, between Jakarta and Surabaya's traffic situation, not being stuck in traffic, and then um, the weather's different in the sense of Surabaya was always like sunny hot. Here it's a little bit gray and it's still hot. And we did have the rain showers like during one part of the season, but I feel like there was part of the season where it was just like completely sunny all the time. And me, I like the sun, so I enjoyed that. Um, what else is different? It was just different, different with the team situation, I guess. Just like with how practice and all this type of stuff. That was my day-to-day -day life, which was a little bit different. But uh, yeah, Surabaya is a cool city. I had a really good time there too, but I also enjoyed BSD. And I think Jakarta has a lot more probably options for when it comes to like nightlife and probably nice restaurants, stuff like that. Jakarta has like a lot more. You like both city, right? I'm happy in both, for sure. I've had, I enjoy the, the different textures, the different 
How about you? I'm about to see it for the first time. Okay. Never had it. Okay, <laughs> I forgot about it. Yeah. Then we also went to Aja to the main event to try some Indonesian foods. Okay. Today we will try five dishes of Indonesian food. There are tahu isi, klepon, soto lamongan, gado gado, and es buah. So this is the first appetizer. We can try. Maybe you can just go for it. Okay. Yes, just take it. It's tahu isi. You can repeat after me. Tahu isi. Tahu isi. Okay. Yes, it's good. Okay. Ew. No, I'm joking. 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 I
No, 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 no. This is egg. No, I'm messing with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking with y'all, I'm joking with y'all. So it's, this from Is Java. Maybe last year you ever tried this? This is my first time trying it. Oh, it's your first time? Yeah, I've never had it. Yeah, it's mm. soto with shredded chicken, boiled egg, and vermicelli. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Yeah, like that? Mm -mm, mm -mm. <clears throat> no, in the soup, I can not taste it that much. Yeah, yeah I like it though. Yeah, I like it too. You like it a yeah, lot. My man took it off the plate. Yeah, Nick, needs, like Nick needs a moment. Yeah, this is very good right here. I like this one. <laughs> I give this a nine. In Indonesia, people eat it with rice. Oh. I give it a. 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10? Yeah. Before or after Koya? Uh, before. After... <laughs> I don't want to say. <laughs> so 7 out of 10. Yeah, okay, 7, out, 7 out, of 10. out of 10. I give it an 8.5. 8.5? Yeah, it's my style. It's good. 8.5? Yeah, it's good. Right? No, it's a 9. Sober. Uh, no, I said a 9. 9? Yeah. Oh. But the spices on this make it spicy. It be a 10. Oh, yeah. Okay. Some, chili, some chili would be good, yeah. Of course, people in Indonesia eat it with sambal mm. and, <coughs> of course, Lime. Okay. Oh. Can you guess so what Koya is? It's a uh, chicken broth? No, no, this thing. Oh, oh that. Um, yes, Koya. Um, crackers? Yeah. This minced or something, whatever, mushed, smashed. Yes, it's with crackers and garlic. Mmm, okay. okay. Dish. And we're moving to another dish. Okay. What we're we got here? here. Well, yes. We're moving to another one. Yeah, it's gado gado. Gado gado. Yeah. <laughs> this one may look not really good, yeah, but yeah, it, tastes, <laughs> it tastes really unique, okay? So you, I think you should try this one. Try it with. Is that peanut butter in it? Yeah, it does. Yeah. Peanut butter and spice. Not nice, not much of it. Peanut butter. I like the peanut butter taste in it, it's all it. See, so you got green beans in here, you know. But it's solid though. I'll tell you right now, I'll give it a. I'm sorry, you guys, <laughs> I'd say 6 out of 10. 6 out of 10? I don't do spicy, so. Is this is spicy to you? Yeah, bro. This is not spicy at all. <laughs> I don't do spicy, bro. This this tastes a little spicy to me. Yes, uh, I'm surprised. Are you gonna tell me what, what's spicy to me though? Yeah, that's true. That's yeah, true. I got you. Yeah, we, we we used to it. Nah, we, we some spicy. I don't do nothing. Yeah. Yeah. This, ah, because of the peanut butter threw me off. I'll give it a six. Six? Yeah. Six out of ten, right? I think same for me, six. I think it would be good mixed with some rice. I could, oh, I could I, see that. Yeah. yeah I, could see that. I think okay. with some rice, it'd yeah. be good. So it's made by boiled vegetable, mm -hmm. of course, right. with the peanut butter. Mm -hmm. Right. So we're moving to the last one. Mm -hmm. It's the mm -hmm. dessert. Of course, it's colorful and sweet. Uh -huh. I got some dragon fruit in here. Yeah, you can try it now. Oh, yeah. Ooh. 20 you out of 10. Now? Okay. <laughs> 20 out of 10 right here. Fire. Man, yeah, this is like 9 out of 10 for mm. sure. This is good. I'll eat this every day. This one's very good. I love fruit. So, you guys got me. <laughs> you must because you're an athlete. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's, it's called es bua. Es bua. Bua, mm. bua is fruit. Mm. Oh, okay. Mm. What did you say is in that? Is this avocado in here though? Uh, um, I think so, yeah. Mango. Okay. Avocado mm -hmm. and then mango. mango. Yeah, apple. Apple, pear. Avocado. Dragon I would switch the avocado out and throw kiwi in here. No. I think there's no 
I said I would switch the avocado out with He would trade it. Oh, you want to switch it? Instead of avocado. I didn't expect to like it, but uh, it's good. Yeah, uh, it threw me off at first from the visual, mm. but the taste of it, very good. Very good. I enjoyed that. I was my second say. favorite. Ooh. Yeah, of course it consists of fruits and with syrup. Okay, so what do you think? Overall food? Overall. The first one until the fifth one? Oh, all together collectively? Oh, so yeah. the first was like an appetizer. Mm -hmm. So. For me, the appetizers and the dessert is good to go. <laughs> the Indonesian food is decent, it's good, it's solid. Good. But I, I appreciate it, so I'm gonna I think for me, the second one was really good, the third one was really good, and the last one was really good. The, the, the first one and the fourth one, eh, for me. It's. <laughs> <laughs> but the last one was really good, and the third one was my favorite, and then the, the, the coconut ball thing was good. I think the coconut ball was my least favorite, but everything else is good. Mm. I think everything else I liked, but the, the coconut ball is just not my, not my style. I'm not into jelly <laughs> stuff. <laughs> no, I joke, I joke. This is, these sorry. are all famous dishes in Indonesia? Yes, of course. Mm. Indonesia has some great food there. So, how guys, so many makanan yang ada di sini. Lima makanan yang yeah, I know, 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 Pantengin Hop Ice Challenge kali ini bareng tiga pemain asing. Karena Hops Basketball untuk rating Indonesian Food. Ya, jangan lupa untuk like, comment, and subscribe to YouTube channel dari Karena Hops Basketball. See you! Thanks for having us. Bye.